Alright guys, today we are en route to Aston Villa versus Burnley uh, at Villa Park. Today is going to be a tough game. Last week we lost to Arsenal 3-2, but I do think we deserved at least a point out of the game. Burnley are a bit of an inconsistent team. Last week they shocked a lot of people. They beat Norwich 2-0 with Chris Wood getting two goals. And I think going forward, Burnley are going to be really dangerous today. They've got Chris Wood, Ashley Barnes. Today I think it's going to be a draw. I'm going to go for a 1-1. I think we are due a win, to be fair. We're in the relegation zone, one point away from safety. Also, I just want to say in my last vlog against Arsenal, I really do appreciate all the positive comments about the quality of my vlog from both Villa and Arsenal fans. It really does mean a lot. Arsenal fans this season and Leeds United fans last season have definitely been the most supportive opposition fans I've come across. So thank you. As I said, I think it's going to be 1-1. Wesley to score. Ashley Barnes to score for Burnley. Come on, Villa. What's the score going to be? 1-1. <laughs> one, 1-1. One. One, one. Who's going to score? Oh, Okay, Burnley at home, what do you think the score's going to be? 2 0, Wes double. What, what do you think about the game in general? I think pretty positive, happy in the team selection. Horror had, I'm delighted about yeah, him. Yes. Agree, I, I like his new position, so he can play inside on the left. Yeah, also, I, we've only got one though. winger today, El Ghazi. Do you, would you start El Ghazi or Trezeguet? I'd rather, I'd prefer Trezeguet myself. I like yeah, them both, but Trezeguet is definitely better. Against Arsenal, I thought he was our best player. Yeah. But. Oh, yeah. Score prediction 2 1. 2 1. Means corner, 28 minutes, bang. <laughs> Yep. Their top scorer, I can't remember his name, he's Ashley going to Barnes would, yeah, yeah, Ashley Barnes. He's going to get a bit nervy. And then John McGinn, yep. super John McGinn, John McGinn, 85th minute winner. Up the middle. Villa. Okay, what's your name? Rachel. What's your score's going to be today? 3-1. 3 who's going to score for Villa? Uh, John McGinn and Greenish and Wesley. What do you think? I'm getting for 4-1. 15 minutes till kick-off, the line-ups are out. Um, I think El Ghazi started up. To be fair, I'd rather have Trezeguet. He did really well versus Arsenal. Who hands in the team? A lot of people are excited about that. Also, Matt Target in the Neil Taylor. I've not seen Target play in the Villa shirt, so I'm excited to see him play. 15 minutes till kick off. Come on, then. Kick off has begun. <laughs>
He's been really good. VAR disallowed John McGinn's goal. I, didn't, I haven't seen him back yet, so I don't know. El Ghazi with the most bizarre goal ever. Burnley, around the 20-minute mark, good, dangerous, but that's about it. We've been all over them. Keep up in the second half. Nikamba, for me, has been the best player on the pitch for us. Um, we just need to hold on, play as well as we're doing. John McGinn, an absolute beast in that middle. Hold on to sleeves. 1-0, Villa. Come on. to win to be honest and that's me being completely honest Nikamba, Hurahan and McGinn Boston in midfield Grealish, McGinn and Nikamba also linked up pretty well but the game changed again when Taylor came on he just seems to be our weak link at the minute I'm not sure what happened to Target but for their first goal 
uh, Taylor just completely left Rodriguez alone and Rodriguez scored. And But Burnley, they weren't too much of a threat, I don't think, going forward. I thought they'd be a bit better, but they just didn't stop, did they? Uh, I thought Engels and Mings did deal with them quite well and Gilbert played amazing, as always. But they just didn't give up and they scored two goals, so fair play to Burnley. We're still in the relegation zone, Newcastle still haven't played yet. So I really hope they lose tomorrow. Wolves also win today. We need to start picking up points. We go again against Norwich at the Villa.